now it already looks like jelly and it's time to uh, get this from the fire and uh, it is a very successful john and this is my first time to do this and i'm so happy that this is a successful one hello my friends ladies and gentlemen a pleasant morning noon and evening to everyone there welcome again to my channel and for this time I am going to show you on how to make a hibiscus jam so please watch Now here, here are the things we need, these uh, hibiscus flowers, then a sugar strainer, bowls, and a spoon and a small ladle, and a jar to keep our jam. It should be sterilized. So we will plate now this uh, gomamella flower. finished uh, flaking the gumamela flowers we'll now put to the boiling water I boiled here around one glass of water and now I will put the gumamela so we will boil this for 20 minutes until the flowers are cooked then we will cover correction on what I have said a while ago that I will be boiling this gumamela flowers for 20 minutes for actually I only boiled for 3 minutes so that the flowers will shrink and I may able to measure its um, quantity and uh, I may also be able to know or to determine the amount of sugar that I should put in which uh, it should be a proportion of 1 is to 1 or 1 bowl of uh, gumamela for example and 1 bowl of sugar for the gomamela flowers to be preserved well okay so we will strain this okay
So we'll put this back here. Then put this on the bow. We need to strain more. Okay, so the gomemela is almost more than half of the bow. Then we will measure also the sugar with the same amount. So we will put again the gomemela flowers on the casserole, then put the sugar, we will mix, and we will put this back to the um, fire until uh, it is already uh, a sort of jelly. I will put this back to low fire only and we will keep on mixing until uh, it becomes a jelly. Wow, it's nearly cooked and uh, I think it will only take a uh, few minutes to totally make this like a jelly-like. The desired result that we want to now it already looks like jelly and it's time to uh, get this from the fire and uh, it is a very successful job and this is my first time to do this and I'm so happy that this is a successful one okay our jelly is now ready to eat this is, uh, again, this is the first time. But before I continue, uh, may I refer you to my previous blog about the benefits we can get from the uh, hibiscus and how to mark out the hibiscus. And also how to make a hibiscus tea. So the link I will uh, post on the comment section. And the benefits that we can get from the hibiscus flower, I will... Uh, Post it also on the description section. Okay, so let's go now to the eating of the hibiscus uh, jam. We will have this uh, tasty bread. Wow. Mm. Very nice. Mm. As I said, uh, if we want to preserve or to reserve the uh, what's this the um, other jam or some of the jam for the future, we must put in a sterilized jar like this and it should be rubberized the cover or the cup must be rubberized okay how are we going to sterilize this we are going to boil in a boiling water for 30 minutes so now we will put the
uh, this is already finished and we can clean this afterwards uh, we can store this in a cool dry place and uh, you can have even put in a refrigerator but with our proportion of sugar and gomamela which is one is to one uh, this is not or this will not uh, become uh, I mean this will stay long without spoiling for a long time because of the preparation which is so clean and the sugar proportion in the gomamela is one is to one okay that's all for now my friends ladies and gentlemen i hope you enjoyed our video for today and i hope you learned also something and this is the first time of mine as i said and uh, see you on my next video take care god bless and please subscribe also uh, to help my little channel and see you bye bye